Hey everybody, this is GliderCat and it's time to play. We're back in Buildermint. Let's get back to it. I think at the very end of the last episode, we were looking at maybe throwing down another coal power plant over in this area. Let's do it. I made some changes here too before. I'm just going to clean this extra belt up. Probably a better way to do this is kind of trying to divide up the production between these two different belts that are exiting this area. Um, it looks like it's fairly well balanced now, but let's um let's throw in this coal power plant and see if we can't get coal over to it. Um, I cleared out a space over here. I think this is the maximum. Uh, it is going to overlap. We won't get we won't get the benefit of the overlap. The benefit doesn't stack. But I think this is going to cover one two one two three four five six seven eight nine. I think 10 more miners. Let's do it. Plop that guy down. It's kind of a no-brainer. These are pretty easy. Pretty easy to run. Boom to... I guess it doesn't matter. You there. Rotate you. Like that. And splitter. They don't burn that much coal, these guys. Doesn't seem like. One compressed belt is um, kind of serving the needs of three or four of these, or four or five of these coal power plants that we've put down. Let's let this coal come down here and then we'll just see what happens. We also, by the way, we are on the verge of having an extractor upgrade. And we have to pay for those. We have to do the upgrades ourselves, but we're 96, 95 electric motors away from being able to upgrade the extractors. And that will allow us to have, that'll also help us get to more compressed belts. Cash is looking amazing. We're going to have the money for the upgrades. That's not going to be a problem. Uh, and that's what we were working on for, that's the last product we've worked on was the electric motor. What else? We're working our way down the tech tree. Getting harder, right? Definitely getting harder. The upgrades are coming quite a bit slower as we play on. Let's see. This guy needs nanowire. We haven't even used robotic arms yet. I'm not sure if we're going to need to. <clears throat> I'll take the upgrades though. Carbon fiber for a forge upgrade. That kind of sounds compelling. Can we make carbon fiber? I don't think so. Uh, let's see who unlocks carbon fiber. Probably going to scroll right by it. Right there. Shoot. This takes 100 electric motors. We could do it, but I kind of want to use those for this upgrade first. The miners, I think, is more important. So yeah, we need 75 plus another 100. Uh, what else? What else? Yeah, carbon fiber for that guy. Supercomputers. The manufacturer. Oh boy. Where are those unlocked? I don't think we're making supercomputers, right? What? We're just making regular computers. Am I not? I'm, have I got that right? These guys, right? Yeah, just regular computers, not supercomputers. Where do we unlock that? Industrial factories, tungsten carbide. Uh, tungsten carbide this one made at the forge that stuff all like buried down here yep it's buried down there nano wire at the machine shop yeah we gotta wait we're kind of in a holding pattern now that's kind of a bummer should we just do this and put off this one. We're so close to having more extractors. 
Um, let's do it. We're fine. Let's, um, let's take this upgrade. That's gonna allow us to get on nanowire and carbon fiber and glass. And of those... Yeah, the tungsten's blocked for a while. This guy wants nanowire. I don't totally care. I guess we could have done concrete. Yeah, let's do... Shoot, we should have just done concrete. Let's do that and get this, uh, get this out of the way. We have concrete needed up here. Concrete needed for this guy. The storage. And it's made in the forge. I bet it's, you know, something by the rock, maybe. Uranium. Ooh. I guess that's coming. We have, yeah, stone. Let's throw down a forge over here. I gotta think it's made from stone. Build, forge, pop you down. Concrete sand and steel rods. Oh man, reinforced concrete, huh? Steel rods, sand is easy. In fact, we've got a bunch of sand, extra sand. Let's see if we can just make use of that sand that we already have. That's this mess. Um, this could be scaled up if we had <laughs> if we had our minor upgrades, uh, which I just put off, delayed. Right now we're, boy, look at that. Oh, that's silicon, man, we're burning through it for these logic circuits. But that's why our cash has gone up, by the way, I think, is from what we did over here. Do we have coal in the area? This might be a candidate, actually, for one of those coal power plants. Do we have coal in the area? It would be coming down from here, right? Nope. Back up way up here. Uh, we don't bring it down. That belt has extra capacity for us. We could run a whole bunch of coal down. That's a long run. Do I have do I have coal this way? Close. Doesn't look like it. Oh, I have some. <laughs> I have some here. I have some here that's getting cashed out. Um, I'm laughing, but maybe who knows? Maybe we've made some cash over time from that. Bunch of coal here, here. All right, where's the steel rods? Steel rods, are those, where are those? Here. Yeah, we're burning through those like crazy too. Um, for the rotors. We tried to ramp up so these belts would be saturated. They're close, but not quite. Yeah, we put in a coal power plant. Uh, lots of inefficiency here, clearly. Look at this. This this iron setup is kind of a mess. Let's put a splitter here and get this belt saturated. Yeah, not proud of this area. We might want to rip this apart, actually. We might not want to do it, but we might do it. We almost split this into thirds. We might need to do that. We might need to do that. What would that do in terms of rod production? Um, it would allow us to get a dedicated line of ore feeding our iron plate production. We wouldn't have to pull off of these belts. That would allow more to go into here. So we'd have more rods. That might be worth trying to do. Boy, it's going to be not fun untangling this. Let's let's go after that, actually, though. Let's go after that. Um, I'm going to take this out. And this out. Let those guys keep all your ore. And let's see if we can untangle some of this mess and create a separate belt just to feed the plate production. Um, 
Mm, like I said, not going to be too fun. You just rip it all up. Uh, that's probably not a good idea. How about here? Pull that off. This becomes our new output belt. And then we can redirect flows as we need to going up. This belt. Let's reverse all of this. Um, this one. Is that a splitter? It is. Let's uh, delete that. Let's just get a regular conveyor going that way. This one, I kind of want, is it not facing down? There it goes. Okay. How about we get rid of this? That can go, that's a splitter, right? Isn't, no, it just has a belt. Rotate it. can see what I'm working towards, right? Uh, we want to connect up to that one. Let's pull this guy over. Copy the splitter. Boom. Boom. And we'll just see how these look. Ooh, we can see we got a problem there. We'll try to just eyeball it and balance these. It's not pretty. For sure. I'm going to copy this splitter, move it up one. Um, yeah, it's the right direction. Boom. And then this is going to become a regular belt. Is that not the right direction? Okay. Just took me rotating at 360 degrees for it to take and actually behave the way I want it to. That's a little better, right? Not perfect. Really needs to be totally overhauled and cleaned up. But I'm too lazy. goal of having these belts be saturated, feeding our steel rod production, that has been achieved. There's nothing backing up here. We've got plenty of, um, whatever we call that, I always forget the name of it, graphite. That's not a problem. And these forges could all be upgraded if we ever ran into problems. So I don't think we need to worry about space for scaling. Uh, this one, okay, now they've balanced out and we're having problems. Backups here. What about changing this guy over? Get rid of that. One more miner doing their thing. Okay, we've got two upgrades listed. Let's see, did we get it? Did we get it? Did we get it? We got it. Extractor upgrade. Boom. Uh, we may be able to solve the problems here just by doing that. This one's looking a little anemic, so let's strategically upgrade these. We have tons of cash. 5,000 per upgrade. Doesn't scare me because we have a lot of cash right now. This one needs a little bit more as well. Just kind of selectively upgrade some of these. I guess I should be upgrading the ones that are within range of the coal power plant. Imagine that. That might stack. Maybe it doesn't. Okay, how about these? Trying to get three... 
saturated belts through here. Especially these two. These two need it the most. Um, so all of these, in fact, how about all of those? Trying to hit these ones that are within range. Within range of this coal power plant. We could do another coal power plant in here too if we want. Um, we're not going to get a lot out of that. This guy's capturing most of them. Okay, that top belt looks like it's doing pretty good now. We could... Probably reverse one of these or two of these. Let's reverse this guy. This one is going to be consumed more as these two fill up, right? Right now it's backed up because we're not getting enough steel rods because these guys are anemic. So I'm just trying to eyeball this. Sure, you could do the math. Let's get more on there. This is backed up, so I want to uncongest this one. Can't do much. Can't reroute these ones right in the in the heart too much. But I can reroute this whole chain if we wanted to. Kind of something like that. <laughs> Then these can all be upgraded if we want. Like, yeah, this may decompress. Um, are these all upgraded? Let's get more of these upgraded. These are jammed up. Looking better. It's looking better. Looking better with the upgrades. These bottom two are compressed. The top is compressed. We have some wasted production here. Just due to congestion. And that's gonna get us more rotors, which we need. Still don't need to scale these up, right? We're just we're not getting enough stuff out of here. Iron rods. Steel rods, I should say. Clean up that little mess. Saturated, saturated, saturated. And we got just a couple little tiny gaps, but I think that's it. All right, let's look at the upgrade tree and see what we want to do next. Oh, we said we were going to do cement, and I totally got distracted, right? Concrete? Yeah, I got distracted because I was thinking we could tap into these rods, but man, we just don't have a lot to tap into. Our rotor production is fairly anemic. Let's look at rotors and motors. How much more of that do we need on the belt? Um, this guy is ready, so he's not going to chew up any more motors for us, or from us. That's something totally different. Carbon fiber we saw is later on, nanowire is later. Maybe we can take... We can take motor rotors and motors offline. Boy, that's a lot of production that we'd just be wasting. I mean, we have a lot of infrastructure for those things. 
bright with these rotors coming in. Although, we're running low on these anyway. Oh, you know what we could do? We could split off and put more gears on the belt and kind of starve out our motor production a bit. Let's do that. Let's do that. Um, that'll speed up our next belt upgrade. Build Twitter. And we're going to de-emphasize our motor and rotor production a bit. Because we're weak on batteries too. We'd have to scale that up. Um, let's see if we can squeak by by starving some of this production out. Um, and I want to steal half of these half of these <laughs> steel rods if we can. We do have extra of this. If I wanted to scale up, I would need another if I wanted more rods. I would need another belt of iron ore, right? Can't, probably can't get another full belt out of this. Um, yeah, that is tapped out. We have other deposits. Man, I kind of don't want to bother with it. I kind of just want to borrow half of these rods, take them out, and use them to create the concrete. Uh, do we have rocks nearby by any chance? Stone uh, way out there. That might be what we have to use. So what we would have to do is come out here or just take all of these rods. We could take, oh, but yeah, we could, hmm. i to finish my sentences. This workshop. We could move over here. This output of steel rods, we could say, no longer being used for rotors. We're going to direct that way out this way. Connect up with some of the stone and make reinforced concrete. Pop it on the belt. Get through our upgrades. We need 50 of them there. We need 1,000 there. And then we're probably done with concrete. Although... I bet we need it for other stuff. <laughs> I bet we need it for different things here. For some of these products to construct them probably has concrete as an ingredient. But let's um let's do it. The only thing I'm hesitating on is should we be making more rods? Should we take that on? Look at this mess. Oh, look at all these gears. Got extra steel here. Or extra iron. Um, yeah, that was a good decision to put those on the belt. That'll get us our next upgrade a lot faster. Let's take this coal off the belt. No, it's not urgent, but let's just take this off. It's getting in the way of our gears. Hmm. Steel rods. Let's uh, let's go with the anemic plan. I'm gonna do that. So you go bye bye. I'm gonna copy this workshop, and then we're gonna exit out this way and bring these over to where the stone is, kind of, uh, which is down here. In fact, we can. Yeah, we could maybe stretch out here. Maybe come down a little bit more. We can always change this up later too. We can always go back and set up more production of rods. For some reason, I'm not in the mood to do it. But we'll see if we end up needing a bunch of cement or a bunch of this concrete, then we can um, we can kind of change things up a bit. Uh, how about you back off and go there? And then let's get some stone, and then we'll set up a production line, kind of along this way. 
of concrete, right? There'll be another belt right next to this guy. Uh, who makes concrete? Let's take a quick look around here. Forge. Build. Forge. Uh, that can be the start. Let's give you an upgrade and concrete. Sand and steel rods. So steel rods are going to be this belt. And sand is going to be this belt. And we're going to make sand from all this garbage over here. Let's get on it. Let's, uh, yeah, we got time. Let's get on it. Build extractors. I think we'll go with level three extractors and upgrade to level four just when we need to. So we'll do these in groups of three because we have to process these into sand. Uh, I can upgrade these all at once. This way, this way. And what is it for sand? It's got to be the workshop, right? Build. Guessing. Uh, or do we actually furnace these? I think we might furnace these guys. And how do we want to do this? We can come over pretty far. I'm gonna grab my upgrade. Boom, actually the full upgrade on those. This guy is gonna come across. Boom. Boom and boom. Tab. Oh, it's not this. What is sand? Okay. My bad. That sand was the, um, thought it was the furnace. I guess I was thinking of the silicon. Sand is a workshop. Uh, I should have copied that when I was looking at it. Let's do it. Then you're going to just come over and meet up with your buddies. Something like that, right? And then... Splitters. Boink, boink. Underground belt. You to you, and you just connect up there. Uh, I think we already have the recipe selected, don't we? Concrete. Nope. Sand and steel rods. It's selected. What's going on here? Waiting on the sand. Okay, waiting on enough sand. Okay, now it's good. Let's get that on the bus. Whoops, wrong bus. Wrong bus. Definitely don't want it on that bus. Um, that's fine. We'll take these guys out. Feet. Underground belt. Like that. Now you can get on the main bus. It's not really a bus, I don't think, but... Make your way to the research lab. And then we can copy some of this. Boom. Uh, spacing's off. Let's uh, fix it. Just move it. That worked. And I want more. I want more. That might be enough. All right, let's get more sand going. What's going on here? Workshop tier two. You can't keep up with that, huh? Hmm. Should we? We have the cash. Let's do it. Boy, that's not even the maximum upgraded uh, miners, right? We can go one higher. Should we do two to ones here? Maybe. 
Because once this gets upgraded, if we need to, we're, we're not going to need to. Mm. Yeah, let's, let's, let's do two to one just to be sure that we don't run into scaling issues. Um, what I really want is this at least. I may have to move some of these, we'll see. Yeah, and I guess I'll just do two per, two per, in case we want to upgrade these miners. Or we put in, um, or if we decide to put in a coal power plant or something. We're doing it. We're putting concrete on the, what do they call this? Concrete or cement? Concrete, yep. Concrete on the belt. Uh, we're not doing too bad, actually. On the rods, taking that line of rods. So, yeah, let's keep putting this, um, generating more sand. How are we doing? We gotta be flooding this thing. Yeah, this is pretty, pretty good. Kinda surprised how well this is going actually. Thought we were gonna be really starving out on the rods, but I guess this uses a whole lot of sand per steel rod. So yeah, let's max it out and then, um, I don't, know. I don't think it's worth maxing out these extractors at 5,000 a pop. I think we should just keep using up the, the deposits. Hmm, <laughs> not sure how to do it. I want to make sure I get, uh, make use of all of these guys. So I'll show you what I was thinking. Let's uh, copy these guys over. Boom, boom. I was thinking maybe they could take over this belt. And we do something different here. Those two. These guys will be in the clear. We have two here and two here. Yeah, we should be fine. Now we can do something like this. And make sure we get at all these guys. Uh, how are we doing? Okay, now we're starting to saturate. And we've exhausting, we're exhausting our, um, our steel rods. I think that's good. I think we'll leave that just as it is. How are we doing? Um, concrete. Yeah, we're starting to get concrete. We got 25 that's made its way. And I think that'll tick up reasonably well. We need 60,000, <laughs> 60,000 gears for our next belt upgrade, but it's going to be a 30% upgrade. So that's kind of cool. And we threw on more gears. These guys, right? So our belts backed up. Um, we still have logic circuits going through. That's kind of starting to starve out our computer production. Uh, let's see. What is, what are logic circuits worth? 10. Let's take that off the belt, right? The belt's already kind of congested. And then we'll try and speed up production of our computers again. looks like we have plenty of heat sinks. Plenty of metal frames. In fact, 
Metal frames could probably go on the belt. But we are loading it. Metal frames already are on the belt over here. Yeah, so I guess... Yeah, that overflow is covered. All the overflow metal frames are going onto the belt. In fact, we could shut that off if we wanted to. We're not getting much for those. We could store them or something. And then put them on the belt later. We'll let it run. We'll let it run until we see big problems. I mean, it looks like our concrete blocks are going to make it through, right? They're flowing through reasonably well. So yeah, let's wrap it there. We got another upgrade. What is it? Oh yeah, the first concrete one. Um, let's just do it to get it out of the way. Boom. The next one is what? Oh, the storage. So that'll be our last storage. It's not urgent. Doing it just to kind of clear the tech tree, really. We're not making heavy use of storage in our designs. Um, what's next on the extractors? What are we going to need? Earth tokens. Oh, man. I don't know what those are. That must be down like... Yeah, that's the last one. <laughs> that's the last, the last tech. We need to unlock Earth Teleporter. And that gets us the Earth Teleporter and Earth Tokens. And the Earth Teleporter makes the Earth Tokens. So, yeah. It's getting harder to get through the tech tree for sure, right? It's going a lot slower. Um, but we're doing it. We're going to knock out the concrete stuff. And then what? I think we were trying to get to something down here. We're trying to get to carbon fiber. Where do we... We don't have that yet, do we? We, we do, right? Didn't we get that from this guy? Carbon fiber in the workshop. We'll see. We'll go through this next episode and figure out what the next thing is to go after. But at least we got the concrete going. We scaled up some stuff. Our cash is way better than it was. We have extra, at least for the time being, we have extra gears going into our kind of hub. What? What? This isn't compressed. Let's go fix that. Let's fix it next episode. Get this ramped up. We can upgrade. Looks like we're going to have to upgrade furnaces if we can. So we'll do that top of next episode. But yeah, it's moving along fairly well. What a cool game. Hope you're enjoying this. I sure am. Uh, thank you to Gladdercat channel members and patrons. Really appreciate your support. And thanks to those of you that have been commenting on the videos and giving the videos a thumbs up. I have not seen a single comment yet. So I'm recording this series very, uh, pretty much in advance. I got the game um, provided from the developer ahead of time before I'm even allowed to post videos. So I'm just recording while I can. So I apologize for not being able to read the comments as I'm recording these, but please don't hesitate to make comments. I'll read every one, even after the fact. We may do another playthrough on this game. Pretty cool. I'm really enjoying it. Hope you are too. And I'll see you all in the next episode.